Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain silent for 30 seconds. Good morning, Grizzlies. Important rules about guest passes for homecoming coming up. I'm Zion. And I'm Soleil with GNN, your Grizzly News Network. Today is Thursday, October 10, 2024. It's the week of respect. Today is Be an Upstander Day. We are wearing Grizzly gear to show school pride and stand against bullying. And finally, Friday, if you don't have Spring Valley gear, any navy clothing will do. We want a sea of blue for Solidarity Day. Let's show respect together. Homecoming tickets are selling fast. Make sure you grab your tickets to next week's dance. Homecoming tickets are now on sale for just $30. This year's dance theme, There's No Place Like Homecoming, will take place on October 19th, inspired by the magical world of The Wizard of Oz. And Stuka will take us to that magical world through the decorations and fun-filled moments of the evening. Don't miss your chance to follow the yellow brick road to the Emerald City from 6 to 9 p.m. that night. Get your tickets on Hometown Ticketing. What's a homecoming dance without good music? This year, you're able to make your own playlist for this special event. Scan the QR code on the screen to request your songs. Remember that songs with explicit content will be rejected, so choose wisely. Then come to the dance and listen for your favorite song to be played. Grizzlies, Hoko Court nominations are open. You can nominate someone of your choice for homecoming court. This year, seniors' nominations will be for king and queen. Meanwhile, freshmen, sophomores, and juniors will be running for prince and princess. Scan the QR code for the link to nominate someone. Good luck, Grizzlies. And speaking of inviting someone to the dance, if you decide to bring someone from another school, you must turn in a completed guest form to room 908 before this Friday, October 11th. Once you are approved, you will receive an approved guest pass, and that pa guest pass, along with the guest student's ID, must be presented at the front doors when they show up to the dance, which means if you have no pass or ID, that student is not getting into the dance. Along with the game and dance, we will have a Hoko assembly, which means more games like dodgeball and musical chairs, and Stuco needs you to make that happen. They are looking for volunteers. If you are interested in participating, scan the QR code for a chance to play. Good luck! This Friday night, we're celebrating Hispanic Heritage Night here at Spring Valley. The celebration is this Friday, October 11th from 5.30 to 9 p.m. Don't miss the celebration of culture and community. And Thursday, check out our Performing Arts Department. The Performing Arts Gala is tomorrow, Thursday, October 10th. Get a little look into what the arts are doing this year. Come support band, orchestra, dance, and theater, 6 p.m. in the gym, free admission. Hope to see you there, Grizzlies. Spring Valley has more than 50 clubs on campus. Have you found one to join yet? John, Randy, and Martin introduce us to Fasu Club. Fasu stands for Filipino American Student Union. They're one of many cultural clubs at Spring Valley. FASU is important because it helps provide a safe space for not just Filipino students, but all students to come, join, um, have, have a good time. And while they are celebrating Filipino culture, they welcome everyone to their meetings. People can be themselves in our club. They don't have to worry about how they're seen. I'm a third. I'm a third. Okay, that's third place! Yeah! Jack, a co-president, hopes we will show up to embrace something new to them. It's important for people in the United States to be able to express their culture and how they want to live and also show others exactly um, how they live, different things that are important to them. Part of that learning is experiencing different foods and games that are celebrated in that region of the world. My favorite memory was definitely our karaoke meeting. There was a lot of music. It was a really fun time. The name itself is gold. It is feats of death and labor, but not fears of getting old. I could and our karaoke contests are like quarterly and they're one of the highlights of our club. No matter how close you are with another like Filipino person, like once you meet, it's like automatically your family and they're very welcoming and it's, it's like a really good sense of like sisterhood, brotherhood, whatever. Put it down, Macau. Put it down. This was Randy. Back to you in the studio. Fosu meets tomorrow. Today is another one of our busiest days for clubs. If you want a creative outlet, a place to talk about your favorite animated works and learn more about 
the animation of all kinds, come join Animation Club in Room 918. Joining DECA offers you the opportunity to develop essential leadership and business skills while, while competing in dynamic events that enhance your resume. Come join us today in Room 201. And if you are interested in the upcoming election, come talk about it with the Spring Valley Democrats in Room 832. Environmental Club meets today to talk about protecting our Earth, so check them out in Room 923. Today, Key Club meets in Room 200. Joining this club provides a meaningful way to engage in community service, develop leadership skills, and make a positive impact. Her club also meets today. They're a club that empowers students to make a positive change in their lives and communities. Meet us in room 812. Varsity Quiz is meeting every Thursday in room 917. Go help quiz each other on everything from pop culture to history. Sentai Club is also today. They meet, they meet in room 919. And if you are interested in student council, you can check out their club that meets every other Thursday in room 807. Remember, all clubs meet at 2.01 p.m. Gaming Club is hosting the first Smash Bros. tournament this Friday. And they are hoping you will come check it out. Do you think you have what it takes to destroy the competition? Come to the Smash Bros. tournament this Friday, October 11th in the library at 2 p.m. Hosted by Gaming Club. Game on, Grizzlies. Hey, Grizzlies, do you want to participate in f Film Club and watch movies? If so, you must get a permission slip signed by your parents stating you're allowed to watch movies with them. Swing by room 813 to get your slip. And we have one more college visit this week. Today at MIT, the Institute of Technology will be here during first lunch. Check them out and hear about admissions in the cafeteria. For students who need help figuring out college as undocumented students, there is help. You will want to attend a college fair Monday the 14th from 3 to 5 p.m. at the CCSD Family Support Center. You will get help with college admissions and financial aid information. Senior portraits are a few weeks away, and now's your chance to voice how they look in the yearbook. Seniors, look for an email asking for your preference on whether those portraits will be in your caps or gowns, or in your black drape and tux. And are you keeping up on the senior news? Each week, the counselors send out important updates to your email. They include dates for senior events, college visits, and scholarship information to help you get free money for college. Check out your emails each week to make sure you're getting the most out of your senior year. Girls Soccer had a big win last night for a senior night. Veronique is here with sports. Last night, our girls soccer team played Sky Point for their senior night. Freshman Victoria Sanchez had a big goal in the first half, giving the Grizzlies a lead from 1 to 0. And then last minute of the game, Mariah Matthews scored the tiebreaker, giving the Grizzlies a 2 to 1 win. Congrats on that win. Football currently has one of their best records in years, being 6 and 1, and our girls volleyball team currently has an undefeated season, being 0 and 8. Uh, eight and zero. Both teams are currently in their first place in their divisions and are, run are in running for the division championship. We are counting down the days till our next home football game next Friday, the 18th. Come out and support both teams at their next home games. If you plan on attending these events, you must have your student ID card with you. In fact, you need your ID to get into any school events. Even if you buy your tickets on hometown ticketing and do not bring your ID, you will not be refunded. And lastly, if you leave in the middle of a game, you will not be allowed back in. And if you can't make it to the games, our GNN reporters are keeping you informed with live updates throughout the games. Check out some of our most recent updates that are now up for soccer, volleyball, and football. To get those updates, follow our Instagram at SVHSGNNDen and look for our highlight reel for each sport. In world sports news, tennis superstar Rafael Nadal has announced his retirement at 38 years old. The Spanish great will end his career as one of the most talented te tennis players of all time. Known for his uh, elite ability on clay courts, Nadal won 22 Grand Slams and will go down as one of the top men's tennis players of all time. After an injury-riddled career, Rafa has just finally decided it's time to retire. Now back to you at the desk. We're getting close to first lunch. What options are in store for today? Today, the cafeteria is serving up chicken filet sandwiches, cheesy breadsticks, and turkey wraps. If you're confused about the lunches, the breakdown is on the screen. Or you can try out one of our food trucks. Santiago's food truck will be coming every Tuesday and Thursdays. You can get tacos for $3 and plates for 11 Food therapy will also be coming every Friday with $10 plate options. Grizzlies, this Friday, October 11th, during both lunches, look for the Growl Points Redemption Table. This week, you can enter to win a Domino's gift card. The raffle only costs 20 Growl Points to enter. A winner will be randomly selected from all entries after second lunch on Friday, October 11th. Good luck, Grizzlies. An important reminder for students, the new CCSD policy requires you to be off your cell phones during class. You are allowed to use your devices before school, during lunch, and after school, but while in class, phones must, re phones must remain away. Phones will be confiscated and progressive discipline will follow anyone breaking these rules. Over the course of these next few weeks, NHS will be hosting a donation drive. We will be collecting NICU supplies, which is an intensive hospital unit for premature babies. NHS will be taking swaddlers, beanies, mittens, and socks, 
sizes, preemie to six months. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Dens Mrs. Denford in room A22 for more information. Now's your chance to grab SVHS sweats before the cold weather hits. Stuco is ready to sell I Heart SVH our SV hoodies and sweats. Pre-orders end October 18th. Sweats and hoodies are sold individually for $25 and sold together for $40. Fill out the Google form on the screen after you paid the, bank the banker. Make sure to include a picture of your receipt. Our weather has cooled down just a bit. Divine, do you have 80s in our future? Let's hope so. <laughs> so on Thursday, it's going to be 96 to 67. On Friday, it's going to be 95 to 70. Saturday, it's going to be 93 to 80. And Sunday, it's going to be 90 to 66. So, still no 80s yet, but I mean, at least it's cold in the morning. <laughs> if you're looking for something to do this weekend, you can go and watch the Parade of Mischief at Downtown Summerlin. The parade takes place from 6 p.m. to 6.30 on Fridays and Saturdays. If you want to dress up in costumes, are allowed, although no masks or props, not back to you at the desk. Our videographers here in GNN are ready to put our skills to work to make your highlight video. Whether you play a sport, act, or act in a play, or perform with an instrument, we can record your performance and make you a highlight reel. Here's our Skills USA members with information on this new fundraiser. I'm Zadius, your co-president of Skills USA, and I'm Lucas, your other co-president, and I'm Emma, your vice president. We will shoot a video of you doing your sport, performing, or anything of your ask for a small price of twenty to forty dollars. This video may include sports, dance theater, orchestra, or anything else. The video can be up to a minute and 30 seconds long. So if you're interested, go ahead and scan the QR code and we'll give you a quote. For an extra $5, we'll air your video on GNN. And here is a quick example of what your footage could look like. Along with Highlight Reel, Skills USA members are selling chocolates. Our Skills kids are trying to make it to state and national competitions, and they are selling chocolate bars and chocolate covered pretzels. Look for them in your classrooms or come to Miss Kershaw's room, room 225, to purchase. Cash only sells. If you missed anything important, or if a QR code went by too quickly, you can find these daily announcements on YouTube. You can search at Spring Valley High School and look for our GNN and Grizzly logo for the correct school. This was Soleil, Zion, Divine, and Veronique of the Grizzly News Network. Have a thrilling Thursday, Grizzlies. Grizzlies.